What? Dude, what is this game? Oh my god. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to our Tunic Let's Play series. We are here once again today to carry on with the adventure. So in the last episode, we cleaned up some stuff. We found a few secrets that we previously could not get uh, before we had access to the sword so that we could cut down some of those small trees. Uh, so we spent a little bit of time getting some of those items. And uh, we also explored out a little bit more from this main area. And let me tell you, uh, there is a lot of expansive potential that this game has. So uh, there is no time to waste, however. Let's get right into it and start things up for this episode. So there is a ladder that we can create right here to get a shortcut to go up there. And I'm going to go back around this direction and try and get ourselves reconnected to that spot right there. So if we run down, not here, but if we go down this way, through here, we should have a shortcut uh, past some bushes that we cut down here. There we go. And we're gonna go up this ladder. We'll take these guys out real quick like. Go up here. And then let's see. So we still never even used one of these things. I'm not sure what that's used for. And we also found this thing. So I'm not too sure what uh, the purpose of that item is either yet. But I'm sure we will figure it out with due time. Uh, but yeah, we're gonna we're gonna come back around here. So the east forest is that way. So I wanted to come back to right here and I wanted to explore from this location going this way first just so that we can kind of try to keep like a mental track record of where we've been and what we've completed so I sort of wanted to you know from the location we came back from I want to you know conquer conquer the stuff that is close to there and then work our way back into the main area once again Oh wow, this is super easy, quick little wraparound right here. And there we go. So this gives us a shortcut access to uh, re be able to replenish our health there. And rest gives us a checkpoint. Uh, so what is this? Ooh, we got another, uh, what? There we go. Yes. Whoa, 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 is this a map? Oh my gosh, it's a map. Ring the West Bell, West Garden, Dark Tomb. So to the West Garden, so we, okay, so it shows a little fox on the right side of the map. Um, how do I zoom in here? I know there's a way to zoom in. So we are there. We are this little fox. Uh, we just got the shortcut. That is a checkpoint right there. That's the big golden door that has the thing inside of it. Um... And then, yeah, so the East Forest goes off that way. Uh, there's a location that goes down that way that we found a tunnel towards. That's the starting location. And then this is that town that we saw in the first episode and that windmill right there with the thing to be able to pull down near it. So let's zoom back out again here. So we need to make our way to the West Garden. And to get to the West Garden, it looks like we must traverse through the dark tomb perhaps or maybe the west garden is uh is a location that will maybe help us find something to then be able to go to the dark tomb because the dark tomb looked like something that we needed a uh a lantern for if we go back to this page right here dark tomb and it's got like a lantern thing next to it so 28, page 29, under the well. So this is the flooded well, it said. Um, I just saw that, page 29, flooded well. So where is that? Under the well, Slorm, a type of slime who just wants to be close to you. Stun it by blocking. Auto bolt, it wants to protect something, but what? Circle around and use the shield. Tip, block. Okay, very well. 
So the inn leads to us. So there is a checkpoint in there, it looks like. Interest. Oh, page 29, the well. Oh, I see. So the well. Oh, the well is that item that we need to be able to pull down the thing to get to. I see. So that's page 29 right there. Okay. Okay. So we got our bearings here a little bit. Uh, it doesn't look like we can jump across here. Once again, like I said, I don't know if there is a jump mechanic in this game to where we can like gap things, but as of right now, it doesn't seem like that is too likely. Uh, but I'm sure we'll get some other gadgets that help us in other ways as we go forward. Uh, for the time being, I'm happy that we found another page to our manual of this world. And I think that that's all that we really have up here. So let's take our sh newly unlocked shortcut. Wait, 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 wait. Just when you think you're done, there's always something. Do 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 do. Wait, go this way. Oh. Oh, these are these are the big boys. They do backflips. Oh 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 oh. Hold on, I gotta heal up. I got I got stuck there, kind of. I can't see. Is there another one alive still? We're good. Okay got a triple feet wait isn't this that flower thing hold on does that not look like this yeah i guess not all righty then uh let's open this manual this overworld so where are we then oh this shows us as we move around that is super useful i thought that the map just kind of briefly showed us in a single location just because that's where we found it, but it does look like it updates uh, in real time where we're at stuff. That's nice. Oh, okay. We can push the bridge down. Perfect. Now, okay, I was, I was kind of scared that this thing was going to like flip out from under us or something, but it doesn't look like that's the case. Here we go. So what is over here? It looks like this expands into a whole another location once again. Oh gosh. Man, what the heck is going on with this game, dude? There's so much weight. Is this a... Uh... This is the temple location. Okay, so this reconnects to the other uh, little cheeky hidden location we found. Uh, so let's check this out while we're here, actually. I'm not opposed to this. Uh, we found a little doll. What does that do? Uh, let's use it right now. Oh, it's a decoy. Oh man. Well, okay. So at least we know what it does. You know what? While 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 we're in the mood of wasting stuff, let's try this. Holy moly! Okay, so that's like a. I don't even know what to describe that as. It was just like a a, a stone bomb. It blew up and then a stone appeared. And I'm sure that would absolutely decimate whatever it was on top of. Very interesting, all these consumables and their uses in this game. So let's go through here. We'll go up this way. Uh, can we go through here? Looks like we can just simply go around. Uh, but I was trying to take the take the shortcut route, you know? Just, uh, just save a little bit of time and cut right through there. Why not? And what is this? It looks like this thing potentially... It'd have like an electrical current in it and uh, maybe restore some power to this thing because this thing definitely looks like some electronical gadget that requires to be powered up. And I have no idea how we might wait. Dead. Oh no. That's kind of sad. I mean, obviously, like we can probably revive it, right? in a sense but it's it's kind of sad that they like use that as the term for it like it is just dead jeez look at this area what is going on here <sighs> man okay uh well i'm kind of committed to going over here so for now let's just stick with it i can't uh, be picking and choosing every other which way to not go so we might as well work on going this way for now i want to go up here and hit this telescope. 
So what is this? Oh, God. there's some scary, there's some scary boys over there. Do you see the scary boys holding the candles? I don't know if I should be here, to be honest. I think I'm pushing, I think I'm pushing my luck a little bit, leaving the main, the main area. There's still a lot to do in the main zone. And I just can't hold myself back from branching out into uh, more interesting locations. Luckily, I mean, unfortunately for me, it doesn't look like we can get through here for now. Um, wink, wink, aka, okay, oh no, it's a dead end. Whatever will I do? You mean I can't go fight those really scary things over there? That's too bad. I guess we'll just have to do it another time. Uh, so yeah, I will take that as a uh, notice to just head out of this place. But at least we got the chest there and we figured out how this connects to that other location. Uh, so we'll pop back out right here. And now we can go over here. Uh, we can go across this and go up here. Hey, little guy. All right, so two hits for all these guys. Um, all right, does this lead to anything? Ayo, man, we are up here, aren't we? Ding ding. This is another shortcut? What does this do? I have no idea what this one would do. Oh man, that is awesome. That was really cool actually. Oh wow, so this is really just creating a lot of like convenient locations right here for us. And hey, 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 come on, this has gotta get through there. Let me through. No chance, what? I thought this would be the spot to let us get through to that chest. Maybe, maybe I'm uh, incorrect in thinking that this is the spot that would lead to that. Oh, wait, wait, what? Okay, so this, so we did travel this little spot here already before. Uh, but since that wall was up, ah, I see, I see, I see. Oh, so we just we just got a little lube around right there. Perfect, that makes sense. Once again, just uh, creating another little convenient path right there. So it looks like maybe I can like, I don't know, grab onto that with something at some point to be able to get over there, get those items. Uh, but for now, that is awesome to have that taken care of. Oh God, this is not great. I need to get past these guys. I am super low. Roll. Oh God. Oh God. What the heck? Ew, these things are gross. I'm so dead. Oh God. What have I done? Stay away. I, I need my, I need my shield so bad. Oh God. There's a big boy right there. Roll! Roll spam! Oh my god. Jeez. It's not looking good. Roll spam! Roll spam! Roll spam! I need to get this ladder. Ladder, ladder, ladder. Oh my god. <gasps> Wait, they can fly down? No! Stay away from me. You foul beast. Dude, it's so fast. He's straight hunting me down. Run. Oh, jeez. I am so uncomfortable right now. I am so uncomfortable with the current uh, scenario that we were just in a second ago. My word, we're, uh, we're gonna go this way for now. Let's go over here and check out this place. We were able to get over here pretty early on. So let's just, I, I'm more comfortable with these guys. I recognize these enemies. Let's just work on this spot for now. And we'll uh, we'll cross that other bridge when, uh, when we get to it. But for now, man, that was pretty terrifying. Wait, what? Oh my word, there's like a little underneath. What? Dude, this game just blows my mind with all these little pathways everywhere. Can we go inside here? 
What's inside? Uh... Is that like an elevator? Where does this go? What? Dude, what is this game? Oh my god. Uh... Dude, what? I have so many chills down my body right now. Are we making a deal with the devil here? It looks like we're bargaining our soul for one of two items. I think I'm just gonna take the flask. Oh, it caught. Oh, wait. <laughs> Is this a merchant? Okay, so we figured out where to spend our currency. Let's go. So we just got our third flask, and how much do these cost now? A hundred? Um, sure, buy them, why not? Okay, so that, that gives us a limit. Oh, so these are replenishable. We could come back here and buy these fire these firecrackers over and over. These little bombs. That is handy dandy right there. Okay, I for a second I thought we were walking into like, I don't know, the final boss of the game or something. Oh my gosh, dude, this game is like gonna give me some heart problems, man. Heart skipped a beat for a second when I walked in there and saw that thing. That was terrifying. We got a chest right here. Snag that real quick. Some more yummies. Beautiful. It is nice to see though that we finally figured out what to do with that. So it doesn't seem like a current, well, maybe maybe we can, you know, obviously we can sort of quote unquote power up as we just powered up by getting ourselves an extra flask using that. But I don't know if there's like actual stats that you just boost using that. Man, All right, there's a lot of big boys around here. And it looks like we do need to wrap around uh, to be able to tackle that. Uh, let's go down here first. Now that key that we got earlier, was that a one-time deal or can that also open this? Alright, so we do need to find another fresh key for that. Oh, hey -o. This connects around again as well. Alright, we figured it out. We figured out another loop here. That's great. Oh, what? 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 Okay, his body was just in the corner, kind of. So we got that chest already. Now, can we open this? That looks like a big lock right there. Um... I'm not sure how we'll open that, uh, but for now, let's go this way. Am I getting there? No? Can't be cheeky and like bunny hop my way in? Dang it. Roll. Oh! Oh god. We're aggroing the whole town. Alright, let's go. Come on, mother truckers. Roll back. Oh, wait! They can they they can deal a collateral damage to one another. They can they can friendly fire each other. I guess enemy fire each other doesn't really make sense, but uh, that is indeed what just happened right there. Man, look at the reach on that guy. Okay, okay, buddy. Okay, buddy, chill out. Let's flask up there real quick. Get a little bit of our uh, health back. I think I lost some unnecessary health there. To be fair, let's clear out all the enemies before we uh. Sort of assess the situation of what all we have going on here. So we have another one of these fork thingies. Ding 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 ding. I really want to know what those are used for. Maybe uh maybe those can channel power. Oh my gosh. Okay, that guy's got a big attack. I did not mean to dodge there, but it was perfect actually. Yeah, yeah. I need to figure out how to get that shield too. Where was that? Oh no. I'm like. I'm losing track of where, where all these things I've seen are at, even. Now. Roll back, roll forward, hit this guy, roll back, roll into him, back up. Oh, oh god! Okay. We stunned him out of his, going for his second swing right there, thankfully. He would have, uh, he would have given us some business right there, though. That would have hurt a bit, for sure. And we'll flask up. 
And all right, we need to find a key and let's check out what this is. Uh, okay. I don't know why you would ever deny that. All right, let's look at this. Understanding stamina points. So we got page. Oh, I see. So roll block. Wait, let's see. Hold on. Uh, so green, dodge roll, flashing is bad, no safety, low stability, hurt more. So you take more damage if you deplete your stamina. Uh, you, don't, you have low stability on your shield. Or maybe you don't have any stability on your shield. You can't block stuff. And you also can get knocked back if you run out. Evade, moment of safety, damage taken 100%. Evade vulnerable 150%. Ooh. Stability normal, special tech, yes. Block, yes. So you cannot block or use special tech if you are vulnerable. Um oh so okay, here here's what it's saying. So stamina, you you are safe when you dodge with stamina. You take 100% damage, but if you're out, you take 50% more damage, you can't block, you have low stability, you can't use tech, and you're vulnerable when you use your dodges, which... Here, let me... Oh! Okay, I... God dang it. I, I tried to press B to roll right there, and I just screwed myself. Um, so, yeah. When you... As you can see, when it's low, you kind of, like, jump dash instead of actually rolling. So, if you're doing that jump dash, you will still take damage if you're trying to uh, evade things using that is basically what that was saying and uh man I just man, I'm so annoyed that I just scuffed myself like that what a bonehead play oh well it's fine it's fine it's fine right, sneak up on him sneak up on him Yeah. Oh, combo uh, uh, bro, his projectiles go so far. Oh, those guys are scary. Oh, oh god. Yes! Get wrecked! Alright, we gotta roll over on him. There we go. Ding, 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 ding. Ringing the dinner bell on this Maltrucka. Uh-oh. One of the... Oh my gosh. Okay, it can't shoot me up here. Thank God. So those turrets, yeah, those turrets, it said that they um, defend something very uh, special of high value, but they are very dangerous, obviously. So we need to be very mindful of those enemies. Let's see if we can sneak up on this guy. Bang, bang. All right, come at me. That was stupid. What a dumb roll. Oh, there's another big boy down there. I don't like that. Oh, these guys aggro from so far. Okay, I got kind of lucky there, can't lie. Roll. Uh, swing, roll. Roll back into him. Swing, swing. Just stagger him. Perfect. <laughs> Man. The, the moment before their body leg like, disappears and you can just kind of push them around is silly. Alright. Alright. Spam them. Ooh. Wait, so I had to three shot the other guy, but I two shot that one. That was weird. Oh, wait. Can I open this? We just got another shortcut here. Please. I beg. Hey. Oh, what a buff guy. This fox hits the gym every day of the week, baby. Go. So we have figured out this side. And that is the very beginning over there. That's where some that's where these enemies were originally shooting at us from. We got a big boy down here, which I am not feeling too comfortable about. And uh what's over here? Let's let's see what's inside here. Uh Okay, we're just gonna go into the back room here. Don't mind me. Hopefully there's nothing too scary in here. Oh, look at that. We found a jackpot, baby. Uh, we found some flowers. So once again, a mystery item. 
So it seems like these flowers are all like special mystery items of sorts. Uh, we got some more of our like currency things. We got some more firecrackers. And of course we can break these open and collect what goods they have inside. Beautiful. I wonder what was in the rest of these chests. Imagine if I was just able to open all six of those. That would have been insane. I mean, we still found, what, three chests there? That's, that's pretty good. Pretty good. I'll take that. We'll head out this way. And now, um, what is yonder? Oh, 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 oh. Okay, gotta go, gotta blast, gotta blast. Oh, 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 oh. 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 Okay, um, I have no healing potential right now, and I am on my last leg. I am doing my absolute best to get back to our checkpoint here. I am scared. I'm very scared. Actually, I want to check out what's going on down here real quick. Is there even anything? Lawnmower. Chop down 100 blades of grass. Let's go. It seems like there's no importance to this. It just creates some symmetry to that, which I can respect, you know? Gotta respect the symmetry. That is satisfying to look at. But it doesn't seem like there's much use for going over there, which is actually kind of suspicious. Can I, like... Are these flower? Do these flowers mark something special? Can I do something here? Ah, uh, I don't know. I don't know about that. That's kind of weird. It is very peculiar that uh, that was specifically locked, but it seemingly is, uh, you know, housing nothing behind it. So let's get a rest here. Uh, we made our way back around to our checkpoint once again. Man, this, this is just a wonderful checkpoint here, isn't it? But uh, we're going to go ahead and wrap this episode up here for now, guys. So, uh, yeah, stay tuned. We will be back again very soon to carry on with this adventure and uh, explore some more of this very vast and mysterious world. Uh, if you guys enjoy are enjoying the series, be sure to leave a like and uh, make sure you're subscribed so you can receive live updates for when brand new episodes come out. But uh, that's all for now, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much for watching, and I will catch you guys in the next one.